What if I told you that simple daily habits could dramatically improve your kidney health? Are you worried about your creatinine levels? Stay with us to learn how you can lower them naturally. Could it be too good to be true? Join us as we delve into the latest research on kidney health and creatinine management. Kicking off with a critical point, kidney health is not just about avoiding discomfort. It's a cornerstone of your overall well-being. High creatinine levels can signal poor kidney function, potentially leading to serious health issues. In fact, over 37 million Americans suffer from chronic kidney disease, with many unaware of their condition. Understanding how to manage and improve your kidney health is crucial, and today we'll explore the top 10 daily habits that can help you lower your creatinine levels and boost kidney function. Before we start, remember that the information provided in this video is for educational purposes only and is not intended as medical advice. Always consult with a healthcare provider for advice tailored to your health needs. The information provided is fact-checked, reviewed, and verified by qualified health experts. Let's get started with the 10 proven daily habits that can help lower your creatinine levels and improve kidney health. 10. Stay hydrated. Drinking enough water each day is one of the simplest yet most effective ways to keep your kidneys healthy and lower your creatinine levels. When you drink plenty of water, it helps your kidneys flush out toxins and waste products, including creatinine, from your blood. Think of water as a natural cleanser for your kidneys. It keeps things flowing smoothly, helps dissolve minerals and nutrients so they can be properly used by the body, and ensures that waste products are effectively removed. When you don't drink enough water, your kidneys have to work harder to concentrate urine and remove waste, which can lead to higher creatinine levels and strain on your kidneys. Dehydration can cause the kidneys to become less efficient, leading to a buildup of waste products in your blood. So, to keep your kidneys in top shape, make sure you're drinking enough water throughout the day. Aim for at least 8 to 10 glasses, but keep in mind that the exact amount can vary depending on your body size, activity level, and overall health. Listen to your body and drink when you're thirsty. 9. Eat a balanced diet. Another crucial habit for kidney health is eating a balanced diet. Certain foods are particularly beneficial for supporting kidney function and lowering creatinine levels. For instance, incorporating berries, leafy greens, and garlic into your diet can have a positive impact on your kidney health. Berries such as blueberries, strawberries, and cranberries are packed with antioxidants and anti-inflammatory compounds that protect your kidneys from damage and reduce inflammation. Leafy greens like spinach, kale, and Swiss chard are rich in vitamins and minerals that support overall health, including kidney function. These greens are low in potassium and phosphorus which is great because high levels of these minerals can be harmful to your kidneys. Garlic, on the other hand, has natural diuretic properties, which means it helps your body get rid of excess sodium and water. This reduces the workload on your kidneys and helps lower creatinine levels. 8. Limit Protein Intake Let's also talk about protein intake. While protein is an essential nutrient for your body, Consuming too much of it can increase your creatinine levels. This is because creatinine is a waste product that results from the normal breakdown of muscle tissue and protein metabolism. When you eat large amounts of protein, your body produces more creatinine, which your kidneys need to filter out. To prevent this, it's important to moderate your protein intake. You don't need to cut out protein completely, but try to find a balance. Opt for high-quality protein sources like lean meats, fish, eggs, beans, and legumes. These provide the necessary nutrients without overwhelming your kidneys. It's also a good idea to spread your protein consumption throughout the day, rather than eating a large amount in one sitting. This helps your kidneys manage the workload more effectively. If you have existing kidney issues or high creatinine levels, you might need to be even more cautious with your protein intake. In such cases, it's best to work with a healthcare provider or a dietitian to determine the right amount of protein for your specific needs. They can help you create a diet plan that supports your health and keeps your creatinine levels in check. 7. Avoid salt and sodium-rich foods. 
Eating too much salt can really strain your kidneys because they have to work extra hard to get rid of the excess sodium. This can lead to high blood pressure and even kidney damage over time. When you consume a lot of salt, your body retains more water to dilute the sodium, increasing the volume of blood your kidneys need to filter. This puts a lot of pressure on your kidneys, making them work harder than they should. Reducing your salt intake can be a game changer for your kidney health. Start by cooking more at home so you can control how much salt goes into your food. Use herbs and spices to flavor your meals instead of reaching for the salt shaker. Fresh ingredients like garlic, lemon juice, and black pepper can add a lot of taste without the extra sodium. When you do buy packaged or processed foods, check the labels carefully and opt for low-sodium versions. 6. Regular Exercise Now, let's talk about exercise. Staying active is fantastic for your kidneys. Regular physical activity helps improve blood flow to your kidneys, which helps them function better. Exercise also helps you maintain a healthy weight and lower blood pressure, both of which are crucial for kidney health. When you're physically active, it helps your body manage blood sugar levels, reduces inflammation, and can even help reduce the risk of chronic kidney disease. You don't need to do anything extreme. Simple activities like walking, swimming, or cycling can be incredibly beneficial. Aim for at least 30 minutes of moderate exercise most days of the week. Strength training exercises like lifting weights or doing bodyweight exercises, such as push-ups and squats, are also great because they help build muscle and improve your overall metabolism. If you're new to exercise, start slow and gradually increase the intensity and duration of your workouts. The key is consistency. Regular exercise is more effective than sporadic intense sessions. 5. Monitor blood pressure. High blood pressure is a leading cause of kidney damage because it can cause the arteries around the kidneys to narrow, weaken, or harden. This affects the kidney's ability to filter blood effectively. Keeping your blood pressure in check is crucial to preventing kidney disease and maintaining overall health. There are several ways to manage your blood pressure. First, adopt a diet that's low in salt, saturated fats, and cholesterol. The DASH diet, dietary approaches to stop hypertension, is specifically designed to help lower blood pressure. Regular exercise, as we discussed, plays a significant role in maintaining healthy blood pressure levels. 4. Avoid over-the-counter painkillers. Many over-the-counter painkillers, especially NSAIDs like ibuprofen and naproxen, can be harmful to your kidneys if used frequently or in large doses. These drugs can reduce blood flow to the kidneys, which can lead to acute kidney injury and even chronic kidney damage over time. They interfere with the blood vessels that help keep the kidneys functioning properly, which can cause long-term harm. So, what can you do when you need pain relief but want to protect your kidneys? There are several alternatives you can consider. Acetaminophen, Tylenol, is generally easier on the kidneys compared to NSAIDs, though it's still important to use it as directed and avoid excessive doses. Non-drug options can also be very effective, depending on the type of pain you're experiencing. 3. Manage blood sugar levels. If you have diabetes or are at risk, keeping your blood sugar levels in check is crucial for your kidney health. High blood sugar can damage the blood vessels in your kidneys, leading to a condition called diabetic nephropathy, which is a leading cause of kidney disease. Managing your blood sugar helps prevent this damage and keeps your kidneys functioning properly. To maintain healthy blood sugar levels, focus on your diet and lifestyle. Eating a balanced diet that's low in refined sugars and carbohydrates is key. Incorporate more whole grains, vegetables, fruits, and lean proteins into your meals. Regular physical activity is also important, as it helps your body use insulin more efficiently and lowers blood sugar levels. Monitoring your blood sugar regularly can help you keep track of how well you're managing your condition and make necessary adjustments to your diet or medication. Working closely with your healthcare provider is essential to creating a plan that works for you. 2. Reduce alcohol and quit smoking. 
we need to address the impact of alcohol and smoking on your kidneys. Both habits can have serious negative effects. Alcohol can dehydrate your body and put extra strain on your kidneys to filter out the toxins. Over time, excessive drinking can lead to chronic kidney disease. Smoking, on the other hand, damages blood vessels, which reduces blood flow to the kidneys and impairs their function. It also increases your risk of high blood pressure and type 2 diabetes, both of which are major risk factors for kidney disease. Cutting down on alcohol helps reduce the strain on your kidneys and lowers your risk of developing kidney disease. It might be tough to make these changes, but the benefits to your overall health and kidney function are well worth the effort. Seek support from friends, family, or professional programs to help you quit these habits for good. Can you guess what the top daily habit is? It's simple, but the most effective among all habits. 1. Regular medical checkups. Monitoring your kidney function through routine tests can help catch any potential issues early before they become more serious. Your doctor will typically check markers like blood creatinine levels, glomerular filtration rate, GFR, and urine albumin levels to assess how well your kidneys are working. Regular checkups are particularly important if you have risk factors like high blood pressure, diabetes, or a family history of kidney disease. These tests can provide valuable insights and help you and your healthcare provider make informed decisions about your health. By staying proactive and keeping an eye on your kidney function, you can take steps to maintain your health and prevent kidney disease. Today, we've covered 10 daily habits that can help you lower creatinine levels and improve kidney health. From staying hydrated to regular medical checkups, these habits can make a significant difference in your overall well-being. Make sure to like, subscribe, and hit the notification bell to stay updated on our latest content. Your support helps us continue to provide valuable health information. Interested in taking your health journey even further? Check out the videos displayed on the screen right now. We hope our content helps guide you towards a healthier and happier life. Thank you for joining us on this journey to better health. Stay healthy and see you in the next video.